Hey guys, today I'm going to talk about how to invest in the Team of the Week players. Now, I did talk about this a little bit in my video, um, you know, how to get a free player, but I didn't really cover it as much. So as you can see, these packs guarantee you a free Team of the Week player from this week and from any week. So what that means is Team of the Week players are going to go down in value. What that pretty much is consuming is that when they go down in value, it's because everyone, the supply is so much right now. The supply is crazy. The demand is a little high, but not as much, right? The second that these packs are out of the game and these Team of the Week players are out of the game, then that means the supply is going to go down, right? Because people are going to put the cards into the sets. Therefore, the demand will go up. And what that pretty much is indicating, guys, is the price of cards, when the supply goes down and demand goes up, the price goes up. When supply goes up, demand goes down, price goes down. So, to invest in these players, I would suggest, the ones I would suggest invest in would be the gold ones, because they're going for nothing right now, correct? And the fact of the matter is, the second that, you know, they're not in the game anymore, like they're not in packs, or they're... There's no set or there's no something guaranteeing that they're you can get them for really cheap or pretty much free. That's when they're go the price is going to go back up. So today and tomorrow, look at these sets. You know, maybe keep going through the sets and over and over again trying to snipe these uh, cards. You can do them. You can do them with the elite cards. You know, it doesn't matter elites or golds. It all depends on what you think is going to go up. And I would suggest you snipe some of them and see if they if they will go up. My guess is 100% they will go up because the second the uh, supply is taken out of the game, like the max supply, the demand will go up, the supply will go down, therefore the price will go up. So you might make like 2 3 k off every single card, but if you do that like 10, 20 times, that ends up being what, 30 to 60 k So I definitely think there's a lot of coins to be made here. And I would recommend you maybe at least give it a look and think it over and maybe invest into these sets. Because these sets, especially when these packs are out of the game and it's not as easy or maybe it's impossible to get these cards anymore because they're not going to be in packs anymore. So definitely give these sets a look and throughout today and throughout tomorrow, think about investing in these. That's pretty much it for the video, guys. Peace out. See you guys in the next one. Hit that subscribe button if you're new. Peace out.